Endoscopic resection has become the most important common treatment of T1A esophageal cancer and has extended indication for T1B cancers. While the risk of lymph node metastases is 5% or less for T1A cancer, it could be as high as 17% for T1B cancer. However, studies have suggested that EUS is of limited value in staging patients with Barrett's esophagus and high-grade dysplasia or patients with early adenocarcinoma. This 56-year-old male, who was in a surveillance program for Barrett's esophagus, was identified at endoscopy to have a mass that was biopsy-proven to be intramucosal adenocarcinoma and was referred to our Centre for Endoscopic Resection. The mass extended from 38 to 40 centimetres and appeared amenable to endoscopic resection. An EUS examination was undertaken and on careful examination, submucosal involvement was observed. Also, a 7 mm celiac lymph node was identified. Fine little biopsy of the celiac lymph node showed adenocarcinoma and the patient was subsequently referred to medical oncology and thoracic surgery. Although studies have suggested that resection and histological examination of nodular parrots provides more accurate information than staging US, in some situations as shown here, while it is possible that the lesion could be easily lifted and resected, the identification of nodal metastases at EUS altered treatment strategy and expedited clinical care. Therefore, enthusiasm to resect all lesions categorized as intramucosal carcinoma or high-grade dysplasia should be tempered, taking into consideration morphological characteristics of the lesion and possibility that biopsies may have been interpreted by non-experts. EUS in such cases can come to your rescue. If you want to learn evidence-based practices and know more about state-of-the-art endoscopy technologies, Please attend Florida Life EUS from August 21st to 23rd, 2025 in Orlando, Florida, where advanced interventions will be performed by internationally reputed faculty from around the world. Please join us at Florida Life, where the magic of endoscopy begins.